What's up guys, it's New Control Gaming here and I'm coming at you with a nice tutorial on how to be a beast with the Syrah. Yes, the Syrah is the last launcher you get in the Engineer class and it is a great launcher. So right now I'm going to show you one of the firing types for the Syrah. The one I'm about to show you right now is it's uh, what I like to call re redirected fire. It happens when you shoot the missile and you try to aim it towards the vehicle and it misses. As long as you keep those crosshairs on the vehicle, that missile will start to try to find what it's looking for. And as you can see there, that missile very well found. As you can see here, I fired the missile at the chopper and I just led too far, which caused my missile to go a little bit off. And so I tried to keep the crosshairs on the heli. As you can see, the, the missile came back. And as soon as I zoom out, that, heli, that missile finds that heli. And that is probably my favorite type of firing mode on the Syrah. Because you can, even if you miss, it's not done yet. You still have, I believe the missile has a 12 second lifespan. You still have that time to come back and try to get that heli with that, with that missile. Now this next uh, fire mode that I'm about to show you is aim. It's uh, when you shoot a missile, since this raw is a laser wired uh, launcher, even if you uh, don't directly shoot at it, like the heli doesn't be, have to stay perfectly still, shoot ahead of it, time it, and then slightly move it ahead and you'll get your target. And that, people, was very funny. I sat there laughing for about... 20 seconds before doing anything else you can see I jumped there but um yeah you you can you can work with it, and that's what I love about the Syrah it's one of the best launchers since Battlefield 2 and see right here you see you can shoot a little bit ahead of it and just kind of kind of let it go and you can hit your target um just a quick key fact uh transport helis are a little bit tougher since they are very slow not that maneuverable um, they have a little bit more tolerance to getting hit, so they tend to get a little bit more uh, mobility hits. While if you hit like a scout hel helicopter with a missile launcher, it'll usually go down in one hit. At least that's been my experience. I don't believe I've ever gotten a hit marker uh, with a free fire. Of course, with a anti-air, since you are able to lock onto it, and uh, the only thing a heli can really do about it is use their flares or their jammer which doesn't last forever it would be kind of overkill if they let you destroy it on one hit so yes with anti-air uh, rocket launchers like the igla and and, and uh, stinger uh, those are gonna take at least two three missiles but with free fire ones even with the law or RPG you're usually gonna take a heli out in one hit but the transport helicopter and typically you get mobility hits which is okay because nine out of ten times it still goes down as you can see here even after hitting it only get a, a mobility hit uh the pilot the pilot most pilots tend to bail they as soon as they see their health their their vehicle health drop below about 50 40 percent they pretty much lose all hope and just bail out and that's not that's not really a bad player trait that's just kind of a i would say not a skilled heli's trait with me unless I know that I'm going down there's no possibility of me like winning a fight there's almost something that you can almost always do to help yourself but 90% of pilots they're going to jump out so the mobility hit is still okay you can see almost every mobility hit that I have gotten they have jumped out and uh, that's so it's still good just as long as you hit it and that's uh that's 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 a good thing that's what you want to do you want to hit the heli that is the main target that we're trying to do with the Syrah. um i showed you two of the firing types the other two is direct fire where you just fire the you aim in you fire the Syrah, and then let it go on its own you don't keep uh scoping it so you aim shoot let go and it does it on its own the last firing type is free fire which to me i like because the Syrah is a a high drag weapon it is very slow so you have to kind of time it and give it its time to be there uh all you have to do is hip fire with the rocket launcher that is that's that's uh, that's direct fire it's it's gonna go directly wherever you hip fire so those are the four and 
those the, the reason why I feel the it's the best to me is because the Sarah works on not only air vehicles, great, but it works on land vehicles, in which I believe you can see here. Um, somebody tried to take the mobile artillery. I come over here, the first missile does 50% damage for a, a mobility hit, and the next one takes it out. Now, don't get me wrong. I'm sure somebody else was doing something uh, that I could possibly see, I believe. Somebody was doing something, but the Sarah is a great weapon. It... It has good strength and in the right hands, skilled enough, you can pretty much become one of the deadliest threats on the battlefield. And it's just something that you need to learn how to use and use to your benefit and uh, aid your team. What I suggest to do is maybe go on the firing range or play a lot of conquest because if you're playing game modes like team deathmatch and stuff, of course you're not going to see any helis. It's team deathmatch, no vehicles are in there. So I suggest playing a little bit more conquest, get out there, get those vehicles in there, and just practice. You're not going to become a pro overnight with anything. I don't care if Naval Strike just released and you just got the new sniper or something, you're not going to become a pro with it. Uh, as you can see, the game still has bugs, even the launchers do. As you can see, this missile almost goes, I believe it goes straight through the heli. Now maybe I'm wrong, you guys leave a comment, tell me what you think. I do wear glasses, so <laughs> you guys can tell me what you think about that one. But yeah, with a little bit of practice and a little bit of, I mean, you have to have skill. But how to get skill, if you don't have it with something, you have to practice. That's with anything. Sports, a game, it comes with anything. And by the time you get to doing that, you can probably hit a shot like this. You know, I'm in the heli by myself. Switch seats, switch to my Syrah, And I go ahead and take out this dude, get back in the heli and drive away. I hope you guys liked the video. I'm New Control Gaming, and I'm out.